the cable entry feature on the D5 Smart. Your first part is to remove this cover that uh, protects the cable from the outside of the fence. You have two options. If you're replacing a D5 and your cable slack is too short, you can enter through the bottom of the gearbox, come out the top and route to your accessories and your power supply, as per normal. If you have enough slack, there's a conduit point here where the cables can come to the front, come up on the outside of the gearbox and go to your accessories. That'll allow you in the future to remove the gearbox without pulling the cables and lifting the motor and pulling the cables out of the gearbox. To replace this uh, cover, you have to enter from the side because you need to imagine a piece of rack sitting here now. You have to enter, clip in the top first, slide it down, and then use your hand to clip them in place. Once the battery tray is clipped in place, and depending on what you have done with your cable, if you are coming in through the front, or if you're coming through in the middle, you will notice that we have allowed some space for you to route your cables into the gearbox to get to the power supply. And additionally, we've allowed this slot here to bring the cables out underneath, go to your controller or to your power supply.